Hey there, welcome to another unit conversion tutorial video. And th this video is actually a follow up of the previous video on the mass of oxygen. Remember that we have calculated that the mass of oxygen in the whole ocean is 1.14 times 10 to the 21 kilograms. Now, our task for this unit conversion video is for us to identify the value of your oxygen atoms in the unit mole. Right. So if you don't know what a mole is, you have to remember and review. But for those who already have an idea of it, a mole is actually a quantitative collective unit for a certain amount of your atoms or ions or any species for that matter. Okay, So you'll know more of that when you go back to your chemistry books. But for this video, we're simply trying to calculate the amount of your oxygen atoms in the unit moles or the moles of your oxygen atoms given the mass of the oxygen in the whole ocean previously and the molar mass of oxygen which is 15.999 kilograms per mole okay so we're trying to know how many moles of oxygen there is in the given mass of oxygen in the previous video okay so to start and we start with the given 1.14 times 10 to the 21 kilograms. So we have two blanks here, meaning we need two conversion factors. Now we already have one here, uh, which we already did before. That a kilogram is containing 1,000 grams. So that comes here. The, the next conversion factor that we need is actually this one, knowing that 15.99 grams of oxygen is present per mole of your oxygen. Okay, so let's use that. Okay, so we now have the first conversion factor here to convert our kilogram unit into grams. 1,000 grams is 1 kilogram. So the unit kilogram cancels out. Make sure that the unit is in the proper places. And in this case, kilogram should be in the denominator. So we're now left with the unit in grams. Then we now go to the next part, which is the uh, conversion factor where that tells us that 15.99 grams of oxygen is present per mole of your oxygen atom. So the unit gram cancels out here, and we are left with the unit moles of your oxygen atoms. So we do the calculation to get our answer, and after doing the calculation, we get 7.12 times 10 to the 22 moles of your oxygen atoms. So this tells us that this value, 7.12 times 10 to the 22 moles of your oxygen atoms, are present in the whole ocean, which has the mass we started earlier with 1.14 times 10 to the 21 kilograms all right so that's all for this video thank you for listening and continue learning